Hello, hello, hello. Lisa Zimmer here today. Thanks for joining me. I used to have something around my neck like that. Today is Thursday, July 25th. July 25th, how did that happen? Hope everybody's having a great summer. It's zooming by. Hi, Diane. All right, thanks everyone for joining me. This is my Facebook group where I educate anyone and everyone about doTERRA products and how they can improve your quality of life. And it's called Yay Oils Public Education. So if you're re-watching this on YouTube, please feel free to join our Facebook group where you can get tons of free recipes. There's all kinds of free stuff in the files tab as well. So please click on the files tab and print anything you want for free. There are some great recipe pages. Hey, Jenna. Hey, Melita. Hey, Melissa. All right, say hi when you come on, because what we like to do is go back after it's all finished, try to answer questions, and see who participated, because we love to give away goodies. And so today I'm going to give away a surprise goodie right on the spot. Hey, Jackson. I'll be right back. You're going to get to pick your coach bag of choice today if you're the winner. So I love to share my favorite things. So here are a few of my favorite things, right? So I love fun ways to store my doTERRA. No, I don't have an special arrangement with Coach, but I should. They should love me. But I love to share ways that I like to transport my doTERRA products. So one of my favorite products, or the favorite product, this is my number one product with doTERRA. If they called and said you could only have one more product forever and ever and ever, this would be it the Lifelong Vitality Pack Vitamins, because they've changed my life tremendously. All right, so they actually fit in the large coach bag, all three bottles, plus there's still room for oils, okay? So my number one doTERRA product right here, the vitamin pack. I take two of each a day for sure. I'm probably going to increase it to the full dose um, here shortly, because I just started... Um, running a little bit, not a lot because I got bad knees, um, but walking for sure. Yoga, I did yoga yesterday. Mm. I'm going to show you if I get brave as we move on a few yoga things that my teacher taught me. She came to my house, and so that was pretty exciting um, that she agreed to do that. We don't have a yoga teacher locally anymore. She moved away, um, but she only moved 30 minutes away, and so um, she was willing to come every time she came to town to visit friends and family. She's going to come do a yoga session with me, which is awesome. And so she taught me some stuff to do just around the house, like leaning on the table and um, on the stairs, putting my legs up on the stairs and stretching. So if I get brave, I'll show you some of those as we go. But here's what's awesome about yoga. I felt like I did hardly anything yesterday, and I'm so sore today. So yoga is a fantastic way to get some exercise, strength, uh, strengthening, uh, lengthening of muscles, working your core, all that good stuff. So anywho, yoga, yoga, yoga. So that leads me into some of the other products I'm going to talk about today because I'm going to need some of this. Because my neck and shoulders and arms are feeling it, right? So this is doTERRA's pain cream. A little bit goes a long way. A little dabble do you is what I like to say. If you need a lot, they have a giant liter pump, which is fantastic. So you just rub this wherever it hurts. So for example, like right now, I got a little neck thing going on. I'm just going to put a little dab on my finger and put it right here. This is my troublesome spot. If I'm on the computer too long, this is the shoulder that gets me. Most of the time, I use Aromatouch. 
So this is my fave. If I'm going to be out in public, I'm definitely using Aroma Touch versus Deep Blue for me. Deep Blue is um, a little uh, potent in the scent department for me. So I have a very sensitive nose. Like I can smell something happening like five, ten minutes before other people. I don't know. It's really weird. And I can smell things that people can't. It, ever since I was pregnant, I got like supersonic um scent and picker upper. So Aroma Touch isn't as strong or potent. Uh, the Deep Blue has more menthol in it, so it's a much uh, stronger smell. Uh, I only use the Deep Blue if something's really, really hurting. The good news is things don't hurt much anymore because I take this every day and it helps with a healthier inflammatory response. So things just don't hurt anymore unless I start doing something new like the running or the yoga. But even then, what I've noticed is how many people have noticed this? Um, my recovery time is drastically reduced. So uh, I, it doesn't take as near as long to recover. So Aroma Touch, Aroma Touch, Aroma Touch. So last night, I did a bath with a cup of Epsom salts and 10 drops of Aroma Touch in the Epsom salts dumped it in my bath, okay? We're gonna talk about all kinds of random stuff today, but today I'm gonna give away a coach bag um, just at random for somebody who's on. You don't have to be on my team. I don't even have to know who you are, um, just for participating. So we'll see, I'll make it up as I go along. All right, so then here's the small coach bag I got and it fits tons and tons of oils. It fits rollers. We got all kinds of different colors. That's four rollers, five rollers. It's probably gonna fit like 20 oils. Let's see. I love these things. So I like to travel with them because I like the material. It doesn't leak. It keeps the oils from leaking out if something leaks. So let's see how many oils that fit. So one, two, three, four, Five. It fit about 15 oils. Some of those are rollers, right? So these are nice size bags. So you can get the small or the big, and I have all kinds of different colors. I'll show them to you when we get there. But the point being, make sure you're always taking your doTERRA with you everywhere you go, um, whether it's vacation, whether you're flying, driving, just going to the grocery store. You seriously never know um, what is going to pop up that you're going to need your oils. So we'll talk about a few recipes that I like to do for that as well. All right, so I want to keep talking about aches and discomforts. So one of my favorite recipes that you can get in the files tab on my favorite recipe page, I want to show you what that is because everyone should go to the files tab and print this out, okay? I created the top most commonly asked questions for recipes and put them all on one page. I did that years and years and years ago, and we've just updated a few times. So here's what's in the files tab. Okay, it's all one document. I have my oils now what plus favorite recipes. And this one I print double-sided, okay? So print those in the files tab. It's all one file. My or I have my oils now what plus recipes, okay? So we're going to look at, for muscle and joint discomfort, this is a great roller or spray to make. All right, so say you only have your top 10 oils because you just started with doTERRA. So let's pretend you got your family essentials or your home essentials starter kit, okay? They're the same top 10 oils, one's just small bottles and one's big bottles. See how cool they come packaged, right? That's the kit and book. All right, so this is the family essentials. This is the small bottle top 10 starter kit. Isn't it cute? It's empty because I already emptied it, but I love the packaging. What I love, too, is it comes with a little booklet that tells you how to use the oils right out of the gate. But even better, grab your recipes page so you know exactly what to do with them even more based on specific concern. All right, so we're going to do muscle and joint discomfort. So this I'll probably be rolling on my neck, my arms, um, my thighs. Okay, so I'm going to take a doTERRA 10 milliliter roller and I'm going to do 20 drops of deep blue, 20 drops of frankincense, 20 drops of lavender, and 20 drops of peppermint. 
all right? Some people are gonna say, oh, that's a lot of oils. Well, it depends, you decide. Um, you can do 10 drops of each if you like, but when I'm in um, aching and discomfort mode, I really wanna make sure it's gonna work. So I do 20 drops of each. You can do in the roller or in the doTERRA spray bottle and top off with coconut oil and massage into wherever it hurts, all right? Lavender's calming. I'm not used to standing up, but I feel like standing up today. Lavender's calming. Deep blue, obviously, for aches and discomforts. Frankincense, good for everything. And peppermint helps with a healthy inflammatory response. They do a million other things, but that's just the quick synopsis. So um, frankincense is an enhancer. So if you put frankincense over the top of anything, underneath and over top, right? So if you're putting oils on, you can put frankincense on, then put whatever else on, and then frank over top. It enhances the benefits and effects of whatever is on after and before it. All right, peppermint is a driver. When you put peppermint on top, it's gonna drive the oils in deeper. So you can make a roller or you can layer those four oils, but make sure you use a little bit of carrier oil like coconut, almond, jojoba, something like that. All right, so what else do I wanna talk about today? I wanna to talk about a nice surprise that I had for my son, Immortel, for his acne. I'm super, super excited. We've been struggling. You'll hear me talk about a different recipe in every video probably in the last six months because we've just been trying to find our way with this. So um, things worked okay, but nothing where it was like mind-blowing, felt like we had control of it. All right, so my son now uses doTERRA Immortel anti-aging blend all over his face, under here, all over his chest, and I put it all over his back at night. He does the rest himself every morning, and at night I do his back for him, okay? So Immortel, we had to get it down. We had to find like the one thing, right? Because he's a little dude, he's 15, and the multi-step process, it just wasn't happening. So I'm super, super excited. Next, we're going to um, try Blue TNC and see if I can't get him to do that as soon as our extra Blue TNC comes in. I'm going to give him a bottle, let him know how valuable it is and how special it is so that he respects it, and um, we're going to try that next. Okay, so blue TNC. Hopefully, y'all got that on Tuesday. It was part of the BOGO, right? And a few people say, oh my goodness, it's $85. Well, don't forget, when you order it in your monthly rewards cart, for example, I'm at 30% rewards, I turned around and I got $24 back on this. They're going to put that $24 in my account next month per bottle, right? So when you look at prices, remember, don't forget your rewards, right? Your doTERRA LRP monthly ordering rewards make a big difference. You don't have to order monthly with doTERRA, but we all do because it's dumb not to. Why would I order Blue Tansy not in the monthly rewards um, and not get $24 back? You start out at $8 back. And then by the time you've been ordering for a year, um, you'll get the 30% rewards. You can look up those details and all the itemized idiosyncrasies on the website, doTERRA.com. All right, so aches and discomforts. Those are really my go-tos. A lot of people love <clears throat> Copaiba. I haven't used Copaiba yet for aches and discomforts. So let me tell you what I do use Copaiba for. So last night I was feeling run down. I actually fell asleep at 6.30 at night. I don't know why. And um, just wasn't feeling great. And went to bed, woke up like three hours later, did some family time. We all watched Survivor together. And then um, we all went back to bed again. And like a ding dong, I did not have my copaiba in my bedside stash. I always have copaiba in my bedside stash. Here's why. I could, when I went to lay down, I could feel that my sinuses weren't open. There wasn't any mucus or anything. They were just inflamed and not open. What I would have done had I had my copaiba stash, I have a really big old two-story house, so it's like 10 miles to get downstairs to the copaiba bottle. So it's going back on the bedside table because what I normally would do is take this bottle and put copaiba in my hands. I take my fingers, get it all over my fingers, and I rub it all over my face. 
right? I'm going to rub it on my shoulders where I'm aching because it's good for aches and discomforts. And I don't need it on my face right now because I did some other things. I'll tell you what I did. Ooh, this is really sore. All right, so copaiba for aches and discomforts. You can also put a drop on your tongue. I just did that. It doesn't taste like much. A lot of them taste really gross. So copaiba on the tongue for a million and one things. Aches and discomforts. Um, anxiousness, feelings of anxiousness and stress. Copaiba is um, super famous because they launched it, um, the year they launched it for convention, they'd ordered enough copaiba for a year, and I think we sold out of a year's worth in like, it was like three days or something. It was crazy. I don't remember exactly, but it was insanity, all right, because people from convention that got it early were using it and then posting all their unbelievable um, testimonials online. So you can use copaiba for skin, for acne, for anti-aging. You can use it for burns. I got really severe burn on my hand. They picked up a um, handle of a pan that was 400 degrees and I don't go to the doctor for anything. And so um, nothing was working. Frankincense wasn't working, lavender, peppermint. Usually those oils work great and take the pain out and take the burn away. Nothing was working. I soaked my hand in cold water for hours. Nothing was working. I was going to go to the emergency room for something for pain because I couldn't take it anymore. And I went to my kit and I grabbed copaiba just on a whim. I hadn't really, wasn't even prepared for it to work. I wasn't sure it was for that. Put copaiba straight all over my hand within like couple minutes, all the pain was gone. So copaiba is now added to my sunburn spray recipe. So my sunburn um, spray recipe is 20 drops, frankincense, melaleuca, lavender, and peppermint. Those four are in your kit, right? So if you're just getting started with your top 10 oils, make that Post sun recipe, frankincense, lavender, peppermint, and melaleuca, 20 drops each, and doTERRA's 30 milliliter sprayer, top it off with water or coconut oil. I do water, and then I keep it in the refrigerator and continue to spray like every hour. And within like 24 hours, you're good to go, okay? But I top it off now with copaiba after that experience with my hand. So copaiba is for everything. Um, so what I do with the what I do with it all over my face, it instantly helps my face have a healthy inflammatory response. I'll put it all over my throat and all over my chest. All right, it'll help um, proactively. Right, so I was feeling run down, and when I get sick, I haven't gotten sick in a really long time. Knock on wood, like super long. I used to get super sick three to four times a year with and need antibiotics and steroids and a nebulizer breathing machine. Pre-doTERRA. All right, so I put the copaiba all over just because that's where I'm susceptible for sinus infections, respiratory infections, bronchitis, pneumonia, all right? So what it does is it helps those areas of my body have a healthy inflammatory response. So I just put the copaiba in my hand straight out of the bottle, put it all over my face, um, neck and chest. Uh, I didn't have it last night, so I went to bed without doing any of my nighttime routine, so I got back out of bed. I went and grabbed my blue tansy. Now, I don't know if blue tansy is for sinuses. I need to go grab my book for a healthy inflammatory response. I know it's for anti-aging, but I thought it can't hurt. That's what's awesome about these oils. doesn't matter what oil. Grab whatever you got. Right. If I would have had spearmint next to the bed, I would have diluted it and I would have put a little spearmint on my sinuses because anything mint is great for a healthy inflammatory response. We're going to talk about mint today, too. We've already talked about peppermint. We're going to talk about spearmint. Okay, it doesn't matter what it is, right? Get some oils on you. Even if you don't have the right one and they meet at vicinity, it's better than not doing anything at all, okay? So I took a dollop of my hydrating cream, which I've been doing regularly at night, but I was tired, not feeling good, so I just went straight to bed. Got myself out of bed, put the dollop of hydrating cream on my hand, put two drops of blue tansy on that, rubbed it together, put it all over my face, throat, and neck. 
And then I went to my bedside stash and I rolled my Melissa and Roman chamomile roller. This is awesome because Lutansy and Roman chamomile were on the logo this week, right? And I'm using a ton of them. So my Melissa and Roman chamomile roller is a 10 milliliter roller with 10 drops Melissa, 10 drops Roman chamomile, and the rest fractionated coconut oil and put it all over my throat, all over my chest. Don't ask me why my arms hurt last night when I went to bed, so I rolled it all over my arms too. It can't hurt, that's the thing. It's gonna have calming and soothing properties no matter what oil it is, or healthy inflammatory response. All right, um, so checking out questions here quick. Yeah, I totally did not know about the Copaiba for sinuses. Here's how I learned about it. I came back from that convention. I think this might have been the last time I was sick. It was maybe two years ago. And I used to always get sinus infections every time I would go to Utah because of elevation sickness. They always had wildfires when we travel there for convention. Well, the time they came out with Copaiba, got super sick. And um, got home, I tried tons of stuff while I was gone, nothing was working. Got home, and I shouldn't say nothing was working. I did not get as sick as I used to get in the good old days. So it was working, it just wasn't like snap your fingers, yay, 20 minutes, I feel great, right? So it was working, I was not as severely sick as I used to get. Because I literally used to have to go to ER, um, get breathing treatments, and they actually got me my own uh, breathing treatment machine because that's how sick I used to get. So it was nothing like that. So it was working, right? I was using GX Assist, On Guard Soft Gels, the bomb roller, right? The bomb roller. And, but I wanted to feel better faster. I got home and I had Copaiba next to me on the chair and I had not used it. So I didn't know what it was for. We didn't really. Um, we get such basic information, you know, direct from the company about what the oils are for. We need to use them and experiment with them to figure out what they're really for. I put that Copaiba all over my face because I couldn't breathe and I had a terrible respiratory. Put it all over my chest and the next day I woke up and I felt fantastic. So Copaiba, Copaiba, Copaiba. My son, um, if he started feeling under the weather at all, he'd get cough. He doesn't get like sick anymore, but he might. I think he's had, I guess it's only been a cough like once in the last couple of years. But anyway, um, point being, copaiba for cough. If you take um, blood pressure medicine and you have the chronic cough from blood pressure medicine, those of you that have it know exactly what I'm talking about. Your blood pressure medicine causes chronic, chronic cough. If you have a chronic cough and take blood pressure medicine and your doctor hasn't told you it's from your blood pressure medicine, it's from your blood pressure medicine. All right, so how do you handle it? Make a roller of copaiba and do 20 drops copaiba in a 10 milliliter roller, top it off with fractionated coconut oil and roll it over your throat every single day. Okay, and that'll help take care of your um, blood pressure cough. My yoga teacher is going to be so proud of me for standing up. I, she asked how long I sit in this stool every day, and I was like, uh, all of it. So she asked me to start standing up, so I'm standing up today. All right. Yay! Yay, all day. All right. So we talked about Copaiba. Tell me what you use Copaiba for. So, um, this is an oil that is great to put on your tongue every single day. Emily Wright said so in her video. She puts a drop of copaiba on her tongue every single day um, for stress, anxiousness. She didn't say specifically why she did it. She just loves it for the overall health benefits. Let me grab my book quick. Books. If you saw my table right now, you'd understand. I have so much stuff on it that I want to show you today that I ran out of room. I want to talk about the emotional benefits of Copaiba because I honestly don't know what they are. All right. Copaiba invites individuals to connect with their past. It helps you reveal deeper meaning and messages and showing up in your life. 
see. Individuals in need of copaiba for emotional health often find that vulnerable self-awareness work reveals unresolved pain and hidden recesses of the heart, mind, and body. Many discover they are plagued with feelings of guilt, shame, inadequacy, or unworthiness that have been absorbed from their early environment. These shame-based feelings distort every interaction they have with life. That's fascinating. All right. Crazy. Everything seen through the filter of less than creates a perception of the world that is extremely painful and ultimately defeating. So for people who have shame, blame, fear, self-loathing, and other internalized emotions. Wow. So if this is you, grab your copaiba and do a drop on the tongue every day. If it makes you tired or sluggish, that's rare, but it does happen, um, then just take it at bedtime. I take two Copaiba soft gels every night at bedtime. I change it up. I either do two Serenity soft gels or two Copaiba soft gels. For me, the Copaiba soft gels is like Serenity soft gels on steroids. That's me all cold. So right now, last night, I took two Copaiba soft gels because of the aches and discomforts that were starting to show up from the yoga. So I'll probably be taking a lot of Copaiba soft gels while I'm getting back in shape here um, until my body gets used to it. But if you're having trouble sleeping, you must, must, must get Serenity soft gels and Copaiba soft gels and change them up. They both have fantastic health benefits in addition to just helping you sleep. If you have aches and discomforts, use the Copaiba soft gels for sleep and healthy inflammatory response. The positive benefits of Copaiba, whether you're doing the soft gels or the oil, you're going to feel worthy, self-aware, they give you clarity, help you feel forgiven, help you redefine yourself, and help you feel like you have a purposeful existence. Maybe that's why I feel so different this last year. Um, that purposeful existence really hit home there. All right, so that's Copaiba. You know what, I want to talk about the emotional benefits of Immortel. Let's see um, how I'm helping my son by having him use the Immortel on his face every day. Let's see what it's doing for him, because I don't know. All right, for those of you that don't know what's in Immortel, and hopefully you've seen all the mind-blowing before and after uh, results of Immortel for scarring, for acne, for age spots. I posted um, those a couple weeks ago, like mind-blowing results. It's because it has frankincense, sandalwood, myrrh, helichrysum, rose and lavender so those first five are five of the most expensive oils in doTERRA they're also five of the most um more rare right that's what determines the price and healing and helpful oils all right and immortel is undiluted all right so let's see i gotta sit for a sec let's see why immortel is so great for my son for his skin let's see what emotional benefits he's getting Immortel is the oil of spiritual insight, right? So it um, combines the power of high vibrational oils with grounding oils to assist the connection between spirit and body, heaven and earth. It encourages positive states of being and supports the development of faith, hope, gratitude, kindness, love, patience, and trust. Oh, I like that. It assists in the release of negativity, darkness, and limiting perceptions. It offers grace and comfort when one feels discouraged or distressed. Right, so positive properties, it helps you feel hopeful, helps you have faith, trust, grace, and stillness. Right, so for those of you with teenagers, I'm going to highly recommend this for their skin, right, if they have that problem skin. Because think about those emotional benefits, right? If you have a teenager, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, these teenagers, right, and their emotions, we need to help them get control of them. Now, Jackson's been using doTERRA faithfully for five years. He's been taking the Lifelong Vitality Vitamin Pack faithfully for three or four. And... We don't have any issues 
with mood. He's 15. We don't have any issues with mood swings, back talking. Um, we just don't have it, okay? So I contribute it, having met his friends, I contribute it, his very nice friends. But I'm going to tell you that boys can be moody too. If you think girls can be moody, boys can be moody too, right? And so as teenagers, please, please, please get them on doTERRA Life on Vitality Pack and start investigating the use of Immortel for skin health, but also because the emotional health benefits. Jackson also takes probiotics every day, Terrazyme every day, and On Guard beadlets, peppermint beadlets, and then he has a mega roller that he rolls the bottoms of his feet every night. With um, I mixed two recipes together. Grab your recipe page from the files tab that I told you about. We mix a roller with the bomb and seasonal zen. Okay, we mix those two together. That's his nighttime mega roller. He rolls the bottoms of his feet every night. Right? So people are asking what book this is, Emotions and Essential Oils. I just get it off aromatools.com or Amazon. I don't um, sell this book for anyone. Just get it wherever. I don't have a special link for you. Um, okay, so that was Immortel. I want to talk about how I'm staying um, on focus better today. In tune. So take some. I roll it. Behind my ears, round two, and on the back of my neck. I also like to use Motivate. It smells really good. I always forget that I have it on, and I'm like, oh my gosh, what smells like candy? So it smells like um, it smells like fruit and mint. And then Aspire. You cannot get this right now. If you see them launch this for a special, get as many as they allow. This is the greatest stuff ever, Aspire. It's for focus, motivating, energizing. So those are my biggies. But let's go back to, if you're just getting started, what would you use for focus to wake you up and get you going, okay? So if you just have the top 10 kit, Frank and Peppermint, put a drop of each from your top 10 kit in your hands. Get back to the basics. For those of us that have been doing this a while, don't forget about this one. Frankincense and peppermint. Inhale deeply through the nose and then inhale deeply through the mouth. Get that into the lungs. Open up your airways, your bronchioles. Get that through your nose. Right? And open up your sinuses. Get you more alert. And then rub it on the back of your neck. Okay? I can put the peppermint on right now straight because I'm putting it over top of my Intune. Many of you are going to be able to do that no problem. I'm super sensitive to peppermint. So I know if I'm going to do something with peppermint that I need to dilute it or I need to put it over um, something that was already diluted on my skin. Okay. So, um, so it's not an oil that requires you to dilute it unless you have sensitive skin. So how do I know? My skin turns pink when I put it on. And so um, it's just better if I use um, coconut oil with it. All right, let's talk about the Blue Tansy Challenge. Someone just reminded me of that. I do want to talk about that. I lost my Blue Tansy. There we go. All right, so Blue Tansy ready. So hopefully you've seen it. This is our challenge. I have it on my notes here to talk about the challenge. We're going to do a 30-day challenge. You can start right now. I don't care when you start, as soon as you have blue tansy, start. But officially for the month of August, we're going to check in every week and see how everyone's doing with the blue tansy. And you're going to report back your testimonials to share. And then August drawing for the coach bag of the month will be based on um, the blue tansy challenge. Okay. So take your blue tansy, take the lid off. So I've seen so many funny pictures. People have the worst time getting blue tansy out in a tidy fashion. One lady had blue tansy like all over her foot and halfway up her leg. It's really, really thin, so it comes out fast. So don't dump it out and expect to get a drop on your toe because it'll run out like water and you'll have a big fat mess. And it's blue, okay? Tops off, put your finger on the top, 
go like that. Right? So not like drop, drop, dripping, drop, okay? Look at how much I got on my finger just now. I'm going to put it on my toe. So you put it on the bottoms of your big toes. The direct correlation to the brain. It's the oil of inspired action, okay? It helps you feel focused. It helps you feel inspired. It helps you feel more positive. I know it's already working, right? Because I've been really faithful lately about using it in my nighttime skin cream and then doing the big toe challenge during the day. Between that and yoga yesterday, my assistant asked me, she's like, who are you? You're like focused, you're deleting files from Dropbox. Usually I'm emotionally attached to files from Dropbox and I don't want to delete them because I'm afraid I'll lose something important. And I have way too many pictures, way too many files. She's like, who are you? I deleted a thousand pictures from my phone the um, day before yesterday. Yesterday I deleted all kinds of files from the Dropbox. Inspired action, right? That's my nemesis is that topic there. So bottom of the big toe, do it every morning. And then put your blue TNC and your hydrating cream at night and put it all over your face. Right. Lots of emotional benefits to blue TNC. I'm probably going to update you on this regularly. Blue TNC helps overcome procrastination, resisting change. If you're feeling uninspired, exhausted, lethargic, apathetic, and you're self-sabotager. It helps you feel inspired, gives you initiative. Helps you feel committed, responsive, energized, motivated, purposeful, and responsible. So blue tansy challenge, all right? So if you didn't get your blue tansy on your BOGO or say your budget doesn't allow, don't panic. Blue tansy is found in balance oil and deep blue oil. So if you started with the Aroma Touch starter kit or either of the Family Essentials or Home Essentials starter kits. In the Aroma Touch, you have both. You have Deep Blue and Balance. You can put those on the bottoms of your big toes. You should be putting Balance on the bottoms of your feet every day, no matter what, anyway. That's the daily Dr. Hill uh, routine. But if you only have Deep Blue, put Deep Blue on the bottoms of your big toes. Now, it's not going to be as much, but it's better than nothing. All right, so start that with us and join the Blue Tansy Challenge and feel free to share your results as well because we want you to get entered um, for the Coach Fed giveaway. And we want to hear what benefits you're getting by doing the Blue Tansy or Deep Blue um, or Bounce, okay? So try to get um, Blue Tansy if you can. All right, so Glory, you're perfect. Glory said it wasn't um, in the budget this time. Do the balance, do the Deep Blue, and save your points so you can get your Blue Tansy with points, all right? So let's see, Chelsea asks, how many drops of deep blue with the hydrating cream? I don't put the deep blue in the whole container. I just put a dollop of hydrating cream on my hands. I know exactly how much it takes now to cover my face and chest and neck. I put a dollop of hydrating cream on there and two drops of the blue tansy and put it all over my face. I don't put it on my eyes. When I apply hydrating cream without the blue tansy, I put that on my eyelids and stuff too. Blue tansy um, has a tiny bit of warming for me on this skin, so I don't put it on my eyes. I just put the straight up hydrating cream on my eyes, or preferably the anti-aging eye roller. Okay, awesome stuff. So blue tansy challenge for August. I'm gonna have you report back every Thursday what your testimonials were. We'll share those with folks, and then um, everybody that comments and participates will get entered into the Coach Bag um, Blue Tansy Challenge for August. Start now. Don't wait for August. Just do it on the bottoms of the big toe every single day. We want to hear what results you're having. Okay. I want to talk about, I love citrus and mint. They're the easiest most affordable oils to use, okay? So we already talked about peppermint, right? Peppermint is, I believe it's one of the top three oils, lemon, lavender, peppermint. So let's talk about lemon. Lemon, an entire big bottle is like 10 bucks, folks. So citrus, so many benefits. So here's my water. Everybody asks about my awesome bottles of water. They're recycled kombucha bottles from Costco. We buy the pre-made kombucha at Costco, and then we tear the label off. And then there's sticky stuff left on the bottom bottle from the label. Guess what we use to get the sticky stuff off? 
And then we just recycle. Recycle and repurpose. That's our motto around here. All right, so we have these filtered bottles of water. So we got a Berkey water filter. It was a couple hundred bucks, and we filter our water. We refill them in these jars. So in this, I've been doing oils for a while, so I'm going to use more than a brand new person. Brand new person, do one or two drops of lemon in your whole bottle and drink, okay? I'm going to do a couple drops of quite a few. Are you ready? So I'm going to do a couple lemon, a couple grapefruit. What I want you to do is I want you to grab your books, Oil Magic, Emotions, and I want you to look up the benefits of each of these because people always ask, what are those good for? Look in your book because I'm going to tell you one or two things, and by the time I'm done, they're good for a million things. So two drops grapefruit. Internally, a general rule of thumb is, 25 drops of essential oils ingested throughout the day. All right, so next, tangerine. I'm big on citrus. So I don't put much citrus on topically this time of year because if I go out in the sun, I don't want that citrus on my skin where the sun shines because citrus oils are photosensitive, all right? So I'm not going to do a citrus body spray, spray it all over, and then go out in the sun because my skin will burn. All right, green mandarin. I'm just doing two drops of all of these, right? I'll end up with a, um, at least a, about a dozen drops of oil. So that's lemon, lime, tangerine, grapefruit, green mandarin, Wild orange is up there. I'm too lazy to get up and get it. So, all right, so about a dozen drops of my essential oils in here, and I'll drink this all throughout the day. Tastes great. Very refreshing. So the benefit of citrus oils is they're cleansing. They're positive and uplifting. Great food is great for hormone balancing for women. It helps with progesterone balancing. Oh, spearmint. Okay, so lost track here. So tangerine, spearmint, lemon, grapefruit, lime, green mandarin, wild orange, cinnamon bark, pink pepper are my favorite oils in water. Whether you do them together, separate. I'm gonna do one drop of spearmint. How you doing, Peanut? Good. Okay. All right. Swish it around. You can drink with a stainless steel straw. Always use glass, never plastic, never styrofoam. Use glass or stainless steel or a ceramic mug. Like my coffee is coffee and a drop of cinnamon bark. So good. You can do just spearmint in water, but I like to mix all the citrus. All right, so then look those up. Let's talk about the benefits of spearmint. Experiments my segue into my favorite room spray, right? So this room spray is awesome. You need something, honey? I'm on, but okay. Favorite room spray. This is DoTerra's continuous sprayer. They have it in their back office, and it's spearmint, bergamot, but you could use any citrus, and cassia. Okay, so I've loaded this up. I've quoted two recipes. I'm going to give you both. I like the stronger one now. What I do now is, because this thing lasts forever, it's huge, 40 drops spearmint, 40 drops of your citrus oil of choice. I do bergamot, and half as much cassia, so 20 drops cassia. Or I used to do, when I first started, 20 spearmint, 20 bergamot. 8 to 10 cassia. Now I load this baby up. This I get the most compliments on. I'll do it in the sprayer, but I also do that recipe in my diffuser. So what I did was I made up a dropper bottle, and I did a bottle of spearmint, a bottle of bergamot, and half a bottle of cassia in a dropper bottle, and I just shake and drop it in our diffusers. I get the most compliments on that. So spearmint, any citrus, and cassia. So you can use tangerine, lemon, grapefruit, um, bergamot, wild orange, all smell amazing. Favorite spray. All right, 
I'm learning or going to learn more about doTERRA's yoga oils, right? So if you know and love using doTERRA's yoga oils, please share with me how you use them. I'm a literal practical person, so I need you to tell me exactly what they do. Um, they smell fantastic, but I'm new to yoga. I'm new to these oils. Well, I used to do yoga a long time ago, but it was when I was sick and I don't remember anything. Um, and so I need someone to tell me, put this one here at this time and this one here at this time. And then I also want to share them with my yoga teacher. All right. So what else do I want to talk about today? Oh, so I'm going to talk about turmeric on every video um, because I did not use this oil at all until two months ago. It sat. Um, I don't think I used a single drop. I opened it at convention when we got it. I thought it smelled nasty and I never looked at it again. All right. And then they came out with a BOGO last year and I bought a whole bunch just in case. And I'm glad I did because now I use it all the time. So all I do for turmeric is for many things, but all I do for turmeric is put a drop or two in my hands, rub my hands together, smell, and rub on my neck. This bottle smells a hair different than my last bottle, but it smells amazing. So why is that? Why does it smell a wee bit different? You're going to notice sometimes your oils are going to look a little different in color, and they might smell a di little different, okay? Very good reasons for that different times of year um, when the crafts are being gathered, I guess you could say, right? So different crafts, peppermint growth in, I don't know the details of peppermint, but say peppermint growth um, in the spring is going to smell a wee bit different than what they harvest in the fall. Whenever they harvest peppermint, I don't know, right? That can happen. Um, what doTERRA does to make sure that every single bottle of peppermint has the right chemical constituents for the effects that they want, right? That's why they have the 54 different tests that they run. So Tara's not just checking for contaminants, pesticides, and uh, quality in that sense. They're also checking for if we're using peppermint for, I don't know what we use peppermint for. I don't know all the science stuff, but you know, say we're using an oil for its level of sesquiterpenes. So Tara wants to make sure that every time they harvest that oil, that it has the appropriate amount of sesquiterpenes to get the health benefits that we want. Okay. So if you get um, a peppermint that smells different than the last one, that's why. Okay. Someone just asked, turmeric truly smells like dead fish. Should it? Well, here's the thing, right? I thought turmeric smelled like cat pee. And now I think it smells like chocolate. And it's the exact same bottle I've had the whole time. So what happens is it's something with us. Um, I used to hate the smell of Lang Lang, Clary Sage, Geranium. I still don't love Geranium, but I like it. It's okay now. Um, what are some of the others that I couldn't stand? Right? But I changed. The oil didn't change. I changed. And so um, that can happen. Now, like peppermint, for example, it might smell a wee bit different from one season to another. But the 54 test that doTERRA does to verify quality isn't just verifying organic, no pesticides, the normal stuff. They're verifying that it has the level of chemical constituents. For example, doTERRA's frankincense, I can't remember if it has three or four species of frankincense. They do that to make our frankincense special. That's what makes our frankincense so potent, so powerful, that you all have the mind-blowing health experiences that you do, okay? So they need to make sure, they want to make sure that it has the same chemical constituents that they have creatively combined to get those maximum results for you every time. Same thing with copaiba. Copaiba has multiple species in it so that you get the best health benefits. They do that intentionally because nobody else does. So our frankincense works better than any other on the market. Our copaiba works better than any other on the market. Our peppermint works better than any other on the market, right? Okay. And what else do they want to talk to you about? I think that's the biggies. And then we'll do a giveaway. All right. So comment for me. What do I want you to comment about? Let's see. I think I'll throw you under the 
fuss and make you guess an oil. Let's do that. Let me make you guess an oil. I'm going to read from my oil magic book. And the first person to guess the oil. I've been doing this at my monthly workshops and we've been having a ton of fun. All right, so I'm going to read about an oil. And the first person to guess it gets to pick coach bag. And I'll send you a picture of all the colors and you can pick. We have red and pink, hot pink, purple, black, all kinds. Okay, ready? This will be fun. We'll see how this goes. This is just an impromptu coach bag giveaway for peeps that are on. If you're out of the U.S., um, you'll pay shipping, um, or you can pick free recipe pages and tools from my website in lieu of a coach bag if you'd rather. Okay, so this oil is great for digestive health. You drink one to two drops in water or in a capsule. It's great for nausea. Inhale one to two drops from cup hands or rub over stomach. This oil is great for muscle aches. Massage one to two drops diluted over achy muscles. I did not know that. I should have known that. Getting a lot of guesses for digestion, but I'm playing a trick on you this time. Okay. Bad breath. Swish one to two drops in water as a mouthwash. Swish one to two drops in water as a mouthwash. Heavy menstruation. Apply one to two drops over back of neck and abdomen and diffuse. It's good. I'm, I'm seeing your comments here, but it's, you haven't got it yet. It's good for acne, headaches, focus, fatigue, respiratory health, scars. Use it to feel energized when public speaking. Ooh. Somebody got it. When public speaking and voicing opinions, Linda, Linda, I got to pronounce that last name. So Linda was the first one. It's Spearmint, okay? P-L-O-S-Z-A-J. So Linda, you got to help me with the pronouncement there. So Linda was the first one to comment Spearmint. Cammie, you also commented Spearmint. So Cammie, you get to go to my website and pick a Zimmer tool of your choice up to $25, lisazimmer.net forward slash shop. I have recipe pages and all kinds of fun stuff. Linda, you can do that or you can choose um, one of the coach bags. I'll send you a pick of all the colors. And it looks like Cammie and Linda were the first two to reply. Yay. All right, so Linda, where'd you go here? Linda said... Experiment first. All right, so Linda, I'll send you that pick. Cami, you can pick a handout if anybody else is interested um, in our tools. If you're building a business with doTERRA, please check out lisazimmer.net forward slash shop. We have trifolds and the Zimmer Make and Take system where we're helping you expose more people to oils with the hands-on experience and um, help more people have more fun learning how to use doTERRA. So check out our system on our website. I hope you had fun with that today. We had talked about a lot. Um, be sure to add the continuous sprayers and doTERRA's um, 30 milliliter sprayers and their 10 milliliter rollers to your next order. Um, I use those all the time and stock up on spearmint, your citrus, and cassia so you can make our favorite room spray and fuser blend. All right, folks, have a good one. Happy oiling. Bye.